with a new... Hey everybody, OWO here. Here to bring you with great pleasure some news on Meta Runner Season 3. Not too long ago, Glitch Production simply posted a picture on Twitter. The picture depicted M, R, and 3 in the classic Meta Runner style. Now, of course this means Season 3, but what is going to be in Season 3? Now, if you've seen the ending of Meta Runner Season 2, you know that Masa was pretty much, uh, screwed over and accidentally killed Lux. And we're only able to assume that it's the fault of Marco, because we see a chip in his Meta Runner arm, which is the one he used to pull the trigger on the gun. So, from what I gathered from this was that for this third season, it's probably gonna be the last one. I don't really like having to say that, but it's probably gonna be the last one. Let's not focus on this being the last season of Meta Runner, but let's focus on what Screen Australia announced about Meta Runner. In an article by Screen Australia, we see that they put $1.8 million for 9 online projects, of course, one of them being Meta Runner Season 3. Not only this, we got a ton of details from Screen Australia about the third season, which I'm gonna read off to you right now. The third season of Glitch Productions' highly successful animated series picks off right where it left off as MD5 grapple with the repercussions of Taz Corp's downfall and the discoveries they have made into their own lives. Follow Tari in its 8 part series. What this says to me is this season's going to only have 8 episodes, but I get the feeling that each episode will range around 30 to 40 minutes long, which is crazy. Now here's the one thing we're not told anywhere, it's a date, and that's the one thing people probably want. So I'm gonna speculate what I think the date could be. Now, one of the possibilities is they just drop it on us this month. For all I know, by the time I finish this video, the season could be out already and episode 1 could be released. It's gonna be on a Saturday, so we have to wait until Saturday, but I should be done with the video by then. But that's probably not gonna happen. So if I were to calculate a date, I'd say that we could get it February. February seems like a good month to release it, it's after the terrible January month for content creators. Also, it's a reasonable amount of time. Now, if I were to name a different date, I'd say in the summer. We are getting it in the summer if it's not February. Because that'd be about a year and a half after Season 2, which is around the same amount of time that uh, it took for us to get Season 2 from Season 1. I'm probably wrong in that, but uh, I don't really care. But that's really all I have on Meta Runner Season 3. So if any of you guys liked the video at any point, make sure to hit the subscribe button. It will help this channel immensely. I really want to push this channel, and I really want to spread more things like news, and I want to do other things such as uh, explaining how certain characters in Meta Runner and other games work. I want to do videos on Hell of a Boss and a bunch of other web shows and indie games. I just want to support all of these great small things that most people won't notice. So if you want to see this channel succeed, make sure you hit the subscribe button, make sure you like this video, comment, share it to anyone you can, and I'll see you next time.